Hello and welcome. This hypnosis recording is by Wayne Donnelly to help you empower your mind. Specifically, this video recording is about confidence. Confidence, how you can enter any situation and be confident with your language, confident inside so that you can have a successful outcome. And to begin, just make sure that you're not driving a car or operating machinery, as this is hypnosis. And I'd suggest that you find a place where you can sit or lie down undisturbed for the duration of this recording. And to begin, you may like to just focus on the screen. Find a spot at the center of the screen and just allow your eyes to become focused only on the spot in the center of the screen. And as you do, you may begin to be aware of changes happening to your awareness of the spot at the center of the screen. And you can allow yourself to focus only on this spot while you continue at the level of your unconscious. Listen to the sound of my voice. That's it. And you may begin begin to count backwards from 453 and with every breath out count backwards by 3 and 453 450 447 444 and you can continue to count backwards as we progress through this. And if you lose or forget where you are, you just pick up where you felt that you just dropped off. And continue to do that. I'll just ask you to take a deep breath in. That's right, fill your lungs when they're filled. Just breathe out slowly through your mouth until you empty your lungs. That's right. Take another easy deep breath in. That's it. You just allow yourself to just blow out through your mouth gently. Still continuing to count down. That's it. And this time give yourself permission to relax. That's right. Take another deep breath in, breathing out, counting down, and imagine a wave of relaxation flowing through you from the top of your head down to the tips of your toes. That's right. And I'll just ask you to, if you want, you can close your eyes and go inside, do an internal scan and find the most relaxed part of your body. Maybe it's your left foot or your right foot, your left hand or your right hand, or maybe even somewhere else. And just allow yourself to become aware of the most relaxed part of your body. Now using your imagination, imagination, you can draw on this relaxation Bring it up and draw little muscles in and around your eyes. This relaxation, flooding the muscles in and around your eyes so they become loose and limp. This beautiful relaxation. And continue to draw on this relaxation and bring it into your eyelids so that your eyelids are filled with this beautiful relaxation of yours under your control. Can allow your eyelids to be so relaxed that 
they just too heavy, too heavy to open. I just want to stay closed. And now, use your ability to focus. Focus on the relaxation in, in your eyelids and in those muscles in your around your eyes. Focus on the relaxation until you know that just for a little while your eyes won't work. It is so heavy and loose and limp with the relaxation, they just stay closed no matter what you do. So when you get to this point where oh yeah, your eyes are so relaxed, they just won't work. When you're there, test it. And you'll find while you focus on relaxation, you won't be able to open your eyes at all. They just stay closed, stay closed. That's right. When you've tested it and found that your eyes are too relaxed to do anything, you can stop testing and leave your eyes closed. And you count down from five to one, and with every number you can just allow the relaxation to release and flood your body. Five, imagine the relaxation flows like waves up out of your eyes, across the top of your head, waves of relaxation down the back of your neck. So your scalp is relaxed. All the muscles in the back of your neck are just loose and limp. That's it. And now allow the waves of relaxation to flow down through the muscles of your face. So the muscles of your face become loose, limp and relaxed. That's right. Four. Just allow the waves of relaxation to flow across to your shoulders and down through the muscles of your arms. So the muscles of your arms become loose and limp with this beautiful relaxation. Just feel like lead weights. Your arms just like lead weights hanging off your shoulders. Three, just allow the waves of relaxation to flow down your spine, vertebrae by vertebrae, relaxing, releasing, and winding, and down through the muscles of your chest and tummy. So your whole upper body is totally relaxed. Two, just let the waves of relaxation continue to flow down through the muscles of your legs. So the muscles of your legs become loose, limp and relaxed. That's it. And then one, just let the waves of relaxation flow through your feet out to the tips of your toes. So the whole body, every muscle, every cell, every fibre is totally relaxed. That's it. And now, allow yourself to imagine that you're at the top of a set of ten stairs. In a moment, we'll walk down the steps one by one and just allow yourself to double the relaxation of every step you go down. That's it. So we're standing on step number ten. And we go down. To step number nine, just allowing yourself to double the sense of relaxation. Just dropping comfortably down to step number eight. That's it. Just allow yourself to double the sense of relaxation. And the more relaxed you become, the more comfortable you are to go on this journey. Going down to step number six. That's it. Just drifting, dreaming, relaxing as you go into this more comfortable place. As you go down to step number five, and doubling in this relaxation again. That's right. The deeper you go, the better you feel. 
a bit of the, fit, the feel. The deeper you go, this beautiful, relaxed place. As you go down to step number four. That's it. Relaxing even more deeply as you go down to step number three. That's it. Down to step number two. Doubling the sense of relaxation. As though you're in a dream. Down to step number one. Doubling the relaxation again. In a moment, you can step onto the ground. And when you do, just allow yourself to go into the most profound relaxation you've ever experienced. You can step onto the ground level of relaxation now. That's it. Letting yourself go all the way down, all the way deep into this beautiful place. And allow yourself to imagine a beautiful door in front of you. And let this beautiful door be the entry point into your deeper mind. You can see the colour and the shape of the door. You can see the door handle. In a moment, not yet, in a moment, I'll ask you to open the door and walk through the doorway and only my voice will go with you. So you can reach out now to the door handle, open the door, walk through the doorway. That's right. And only my voice goes with you as you step into your deeper mind. Shut the door behind you and now you're safe and secure in the sanctuary of your deeper mind and begin to have a look around and just enjoy going down with every step deeper into your deeper mind and ask your unconscious your unconscious to show you the symbol for the part of you that doubts and self-doubts. Where is it? Just there or there? No, there it is. So just isolate it and just ask your unconscious how to take the power out of that symbol. You may shrink it, you may change its colour, we might just drain the power away. And go ahead and do this now draining all the power out of the symbol for self-doubt. And just leave it there. Now look for the symbol, for the part of you that is the hero, that is confident and that totally believes, totally believes in yourself. Ah, there, where is it? There, there it is. Let's ask your unconscious how to grow the power of this symbol. You may make the symbol bigger, more colourful, just add more power to it. That's it. And now just allow the symbol for your hero to overcome the symbol for self-doubt until the symbol for the hero becomes the victor. When it does, ask and invite the symbol for the part of you that is your hero, your confident hero to come towards you. Give thanks for the part of you that is the hero and just allow the symbol to integrate into you, absorbing into every cell of your body the hero, the confidence, positive self-image. With all the power and the energy of the victor. And when this is done, the hero has become you and you have become the hero in your own story. Give thanks and continue the journey. And as you continue the journey down deeper 
into your deeper mind where the resources are feel greater confidence and achievement and success and as you go along this journey you may notice a very comfortable chair on the pathway next to the pathway that you're on so allow yourself to you know, sit in this chair let it relax you you may hear the sound of water lapping in a nearby nearby waterway and as you do let yourself sink even more deeply into a comfortable place where you can just let the world go by drifting and dreaming even more deeply with every breath out just let yourself double the sense of relaxation with every word I say you can double your sense of comfort that's right and allow yourself in the your mind's eye. Become aware of a picture and allow yourself to see the picture of the confident version of you, the super confident version of you. And you're the you're the artist. So go ahead and Paint the picture, seeing a confident version of you dressed a certain way, standing a certain way, speaking a certain way, and all of this exudes confidence, strength, power, success, achievement, and make this a very dynamic picture. And as you do this, paint it on a beautiful background in the context of the success that you desire the confidence in the situation you want it and when you've got the picture as beautiful as it can be and you think this is a masterpiece that you have created then you can allow yourself on the count of three to float up off the chair maybe you might even want to use a helicopter to float out of the chair and into the picture so that you can stand in the body of the confident successful achieving version of you so one two three just float off the chair by whatever means possible, float into the picture of the ideal, confident, successful, achieving version of you. And as you do, standing now in the body of the ideal, confident you, seeing through the eyes of the ideal, confident you, hearing through the ears of the ideal, confident you, and feeling what it feels like to be in the body of the ideal confident you that's it and as you feel this power this strength this energy this confident be aware of what you're now saying to yourself that you are confident you can you are doing all these things and as you Listen to this new self-talk. Allow yourself to drop down inside the ideal, confident, successful you and tap into the beliefs that are down deep in the programs that are driving you to be successful, confident. That's it. Tap into these beliefs. Grab hold of these beliefs these values, this identity 
as the ideal successful you. And as you bring them all together, working it out, I'll count to three. And as I count to three, and you can be aware of the machinations and making it all happen. And just allow your unconscious to bring these things back with you from the picture back into the chair. One, two, three. Wrap up all these things, all the beliefs. Bring them back to the chair that you are relaxing in on the pathway, next to the pathway in your unconscious mind. And then continue your journey along the pathway in your deeper mind. That's right. And as you progress down the path, just allow yourself, allow your unconscious to become aware of what looks like a tangled fishing line on the side of the path. And what's interesting is that your unconscious knows how to untangle any fishing line. And while your conscious mind may think it's challenging or impossible, your unconscious mind knows exactly what to do to untangle the line as you step forward and you reach out and as you pick up the fishing line your unconscious untangles it and makes sense of it all and you never know when your unconscious will help you to untangle the lines so that you can be confident of making sense of things that don't seem to make sense. You can be confident where before there was self-doubt. And you may look around. You may look around inside your deeper mind and just allow your unconscious to sort it out. Just allow your unconscious to clean up any other things that need to be cleaned up. That's right. And now, as you look around, I'll just ask you to consider your favourite colour. Whenever you see your favourite colour in clothing or in traffic or anywhere in nature, it'll remind you how strong and confident and powerful you really are. So it's about time to come back to the here and now where you can use confidence to achieve whatever it is you set out to achieve. So I'll count from one to five and with each number as you come back, your confidence can grow stronger and stronger. A thousand times stronger with every number going up and your favourite colour reminding you how confident you really are. So one, beginning to come back, just getting a sense of the room. And your favourite colour reminding you, you are a confident person. Two, your confidence grows a thousand times stronger. Your favourite colour reminding you how strong, how confident you really are. Three, and just take a nice a deep a breath in, moving your hands and feet, getting a thousand times stronger in your confidence. That's right. Four, you can have a stretch, getting a thousand times stronger in your confidence. Five, another thousand times stronger, becoming refreshed, relaxed, alert, feeling great in every way and feeling super confident in everything you do. So you take a moment to enjoy the sense of confidence that you now have. And when you're ready, continue on your day. Thank you very much for listening to this recording. If you'd like to learn more, you'd like to learn more, contact wayne at waynedonnelly.com W-A-Y-N-E-D-O-N-N-E-L-L-Y Thank you and have a great day.